Hello, Chad. Happy Wednesday. How's it going? Are you guys ready for me to beat Rolana today? Because I am. I'm going to win. It'll be easy. <clears throat> also, this artist, by the way, she's so good. Lafe. I love her. I love her jazzy vibe. It's cute. Oh, here comes Cade. He knows. Yeah. I don't like that song. This is a song of random music from a playlist I like. But sometimes I don't like the song. But yeah, guys. <clears throat> Watch, it is going to take all stream because you are going to stall. Well, chat, you have to help me with it. You know, your music is good. Thank you, Kutharpan. Kuthi Poopy. Howdy doody. Yeah, I'm gonna stall so then I don't win. Don't worry. I've got it. I sw I've, I can feel it. Also, I've made the decision. I'm probably not gonna collect any more Skadoosh fragments. Well, I'm gonna tr get to like 14 and then I think I'm gonna call it. Because I'm afraid. Listen, I know this is rune level one. I was discussing this with Kenny. <laughs> I know this is rune level one, but I'm actually afraid of being too strong. <laughs> and then it being like boring because it's too easy, which isn't really possible. But I'm afraid that I'm going to get to Mesmer and I'm going to have like way too many and then I'm going to kill him really fast and then I'm going to be sad. You know, I don't know. I was just thinking about it. I think I'll go to 14 and then I'll be good. And then maybe for consort will get to 20 just because that fight's going to suck. But I guess we'll just kind of see how I feel because I feel like the damage we have now is really fair and still challenging without like being super broken which is what i want <laughs> huh okay yes wow look at that fur say hi to chat you have to look here no no okay or just turn he's getting in a bad i don't know if this is a good or bad habit or not but he knows that when this light is on and i start talking into the microphone someone's gonna bless him I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, but it's not up to me to decide, kid. They got to give their channel points. <laughs> but yeah. Rel also, Grey Katana is the best choice ever. Like, I don't want to use anything else. I did get offline. I got the rest of the somber bells. I was missing two of them. And um, I needed them so I can level up great Dragon Great Katana for Bail the Dread um, when we fight him eventually. And so I had to kill a fall Falling Star Beast in Celia Tunnel. And it took, like, no time at all. It took no time at all. <laughs> it was really easy. <laughs> So that's good. And then the other one I was just like literally just did not pick up. So that was embarrassing. Kate, what are you doing? Of the channel point required for treats so Kate doesn't cover the screen until he gets what he wants. I know. I'm like, I might have to up the channel points chat because he's getting in a bad habit. He thinks that streaming is for him. It's not. <laughs> I might have to. I might have to up the points. Yeah. Not like it'll really matter that much. Y'all who are here have so many channel. Well, unless you gambled a believer, then you probably have nothing. Um, don't ever believe in me. Chat. No, no, do. Wait, sorry. Believe in me. I need to. What the hell? Why is that so loud? I love this song. This song is so good. But it, like, daily quested me. 
Yeah. Yeah, naughty little thing. He thinks that the world revolves around him. When I go to bed at night, he'll like, I'll lay like on my back and he'll get on my chest and I'm like, oh, that's so wholesome. He wants to cuddle. And then he starts harassing me um, by licking me in the face. And I'm like, nah, 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 for like 10 minutes until he gets off. Because I want to cuddle with him, but I don't want him to lick me because it's weird. <laughs> Believer's points are safe with you, Ganon Kick. They are uh, totally safe with the doubt root. I didn't say that. You didn't hear anything. Yeah. Hey, you need to hold still. You, you, you need to hold still. Cats are like toddlers. <laughs> hold still. Just hold still. Yeah, holds still like all day long except when I'm interacting with him. And then as soon as I start interacting with him, he's like, I got to move like 12 times in a row. Yep, there he goes again. He's moving again. Such a silly guy. Yeah, RL1. So this is also the plan too. After Rolana, I think I want to fight Putrescent Knight because I don't think he's I mean this is famous last words but I don't think he's gonna be that bad I don't find him a very difficult boss um in general there's a couple of moves but I think we're, we're gonna go there next because I feel like I'm gonna struggle to get there more than I'm gonna struggle fighting him I feel like the the path to get to putrescent night is way worse than Putressa Knight itself. Um, just for all over my mic now. I'm scared to get to Putressa Knight, so we might as well just like nip that in the bud and get it out of the way and cry about it later. I'm gonna die so much <laughs> trying to just get there. It's so annoying. You know, those guys were never a danger ever in the base game. And then the DLC Miyazaki was like, <laughs> you know what would be hilarious? If we made the if we made the circle thing what what are they even called? If we made those guys super dangerous, like <laughs> Oh no! What is this? Oh no, Rolana dead in five tries. Oh shit. Oh chat. We got five minutes of stalling then. Five minutes to stall? I will stall for five minutes. Easy. I just started opening up my game. <laughs> um, yeah. No, I totally got this. I, um... Also was watching, I was watching Distortions 2's um, YouTube video where he did the porcupine spell run. And now, you do you guys remember when I was doing the mage run? I was having a really hard time dodging one of Mesmer's moves. Like I, for some reason, I just... For some reason I couldn't dodge it like I always got hit by like the backswing so he like does like a like a fire tornado where he like goes over top of your head and then like behind you and he would like catch me with the back one and I literally watched somebody I literally watched somebody I watched distortion dodging it and I was like oh so now I know how to do that at least, so we'll I'll learn that. It'll be great. At least now I know because I've seen it, you know? You guys know? Come on, controller. I might have to restart my game. But I also learned um I need 70,000. Uh 
I need 70,000 runes to um, level up the dragon katana. So when we beat Rolana, because we're going to do it. <laughs> Easy. Okay, I got to restart the game. <sighs> when we beat Rolana, I got to come back and level up the katana. It must be done. It must be done. I don't make the rules, chat. Um, okay. Never heard this song in my life. But it's kind of nice. It's good music. Good music. Chat! Put in your points now! Or else we're going to have to do another prediction. Where, when more people show up or something, I don't know. <laughs> Put in your TED points now. Mm -hmm. uh, game? Hello? Game? Please? Oh my god. Carol. Game isn't wanting to work. There we go. Mm hmm. Oh, also, I was reading some lore, and at first, I was like, holy shit, this is, like, crackpot. Like, what the fuck? How? No one can actually believe that. But then the more I was reading this post on Reddit, the more I was like, wait, what? America's a fucking alien. <laughs> there you go. There's your crackpot theory for the day. Let that sink in. Hi. <laughs> okay. Chill, brother. All right. So, so the, oh no. Why is game not what what is happening? My controller is shitting itself for some reason. It doesn't want to move me. Hello? What is happening? What is happening? There we go. <laughs> Is being weird. All right, chat. Let's kill Rolana right now. I know I can do it. And I don't want to stall because I want to win. All right. So. Oh, really? Am I really? Why was I wearing that? Alright chat, here we go. Rolana is about to die. Prepare your butts. Cause she's totally gonna die right now. Watch me walk in and die. Uh, is my game sound on? Okay. Oh, I'm dead. My game lagged. Great. We're off to a good start. <laughs> That's fabulous. <laughs> my game lagged and it was over. Well,
That's not my fault. Hello, hi, Sha. This is probably why I was wearing this then. I just died to fucking lag. How are you? <laughs> For some reason, this Rolana fight has some pretty, I guess some like really bad like lag spikes in like the Rolana fights. Do you know right how it goes it? Goes well, I'm ready to win. Except maybe not with this fr freaking rain, bro. I would like to hit her. <laughs> I would like to hit her. Paid. No. Cage is in my way. Beat her right now. This is the point where it gets really scary. I'm dead. Ugh. I'm dead. <laughs> I, I greeted and I knew. <laughs> well, rip. Good run though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You literally, I don't know why I did that because I know for a fact that I cannot read in the second phase like at all i just can't do it but i did it anyway because i'm a greedy bitch <laughs> why am i like this <laughs> we'll get her soon i'm calm <sighs> it will work this time yeah this time i'm not gonna greed i'm gonna be calm and collected hey <laughs> Worth. I mean, the greed will work this time. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Totally. Calm, collected, greedy. Yeah. I feel like with her, you have to be a little greedy. was ass <laughs> she didn't do her super mega lightning see this is the other thing too if i like phase her too fast she will skip her her flame thing and then it's just a little it gets scary <laughs> no it's fine palm collected crazy The most calm, greedy person you've ever seen in your life. Okay, Rolana, please. Thank you. I'm dead. <laughs> Hilarious. I love the runs where I walk in and then she just stalls and stalls and stalls and stalls. And then when I'm like, oh, I finally have a chance. She fucking kills me instantly. 
so dumb. I hate that. Well, whatever. Not that it matters, but this is four of five. <laughs> yeah. Almost died because of the you know, almost died because of chair. <laughs> Get her. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. enough I'm dead I'm alive I, I forgot I forgot <laughs> uh, you in this first phase she does the the up cross thing this right in the first phase you can punish it. In the second phase, you can't. Because she has a follow-up. Holy heart race. My heart is racing. Chill, girl. You haven't won yet. Alright. Yikes. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Don't greed. I'm fucking dead. <laughs> Yikes. That sucked. See, this is why we say calm, collected, and greedy with her. Because if I'm not being a little greedy, then I don't get to hit her. And it's sad. Hi, Noir. How are you doing? Hello there. General Kenobi, how's it going? You must say, General Kenobi, it is the law. Happy Wednesday. Uh, 
I'm well, you, I am great. I have to beat this boss right now. Cade, don't. Oh, I'm dead. I'm alive. What the hell? All right. I'm having breakfast now. It's Thursday for you. Hell yeah. Oh, that sounds bad. What are you eating? We're alive! Fault! Ah! I have to let me win. <laughs> How are you doing, Bolt? Where the hell is she going, bro? Oh, she did the same move. I'm dead. I'm so dead. <gasps> Scary. I took a chance because, man, it feels like I have to be so greedy with her. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, that was rough. That was rough. Hmm. Yeah, hi, kid. I was like, greed? Maybe? Nice attempt. Thank you. Yeah. I don't know. In her second phase, it feels like you if you don't greed, like... You just spend your time, like, running around, like, praying for some sort of opening? Maybe? Question mark? Maybe. <laughs> what the fuck, Girl. Girl. I think that's how I did the whole fight, running and praying and bonking with the dark moon <laughs> sword. Your baby must feed cat. Fair. Feed cat. Plant. That is very important or evil eat you. Yikes. Don't ever do that. Oh, Rolana. Damn, girl. Probably doesn't help that. My cat is in the way. Do you think you'll ever stop? No. At this point, I'm used to it. Scuff? Lag? Cats? This is why I'm a really good gaber, because I'm constantly impeded by um, things outside of my skills. Always good when I don't have to heal for this. Oh. Get her. God. Ugh. <laughs> Shit. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right.
No. No. Oh, shit. <laughs> so that's interesting. That's actually the second time I've done that. When she's, if I'm like right next to her and I do like the thrust, she actually misses me with like the laser beam, but then hits me when she turns around. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> that was really close. I, I, I got this. It's soon, soon. She will be dead, and I will move on. Surely. Oh look, it's my favorite cat. <gasps> Ares, you are here. I was actually just stalling for you this whole time. I was actually stalling for you. How are you doing? I'm dead. I was stalling for you. That that was really bad orange. <laughs> How nice of you. Yes, yes, of course. I'm stalling for you because um, when you missed the vine line, I felt very bad. <laughs> Also, I actually almost got her, but I threw. But is it throwing, though? Because her second phase is ass. <sighs> oh, Rolana, your second phase. When will I learn that my actions have consequences? <sighs> it's fine. Uh, yeah. We just have to go like this. What the... The lag, bro. Showing off them legs or all. Yeah. Gotta show them legs. Oh. Luck. No! Get! Holy, she is down for like ever. No! Oh. I'm dead. I got stuck by the wall. <laughs> Speaking of ass, I'm excited to see the Mesmer fight. Me when Mesmer. Oh, yeah, I'm really excited. To do the Mesmer fight rune level one. <laughs> okay, yeah, that's like the one I'm really looking forward to. I'm really looking forward to that one. <laughs> I'm really excited about it. And Midra. Midra and Mesmer are the fights I'm most excited for. I'm really excited for that. Because <laughs> I think they're going to be really fun. I actually think Rolan is pretty fun too. And I actually really enjoy Dancing Beast. Are you gonna beat Matir without undodgeable? Um, well. I either kill her before laser beam or um I either kill her before laser beam or I just hope that I have the bubble and um Yeah, I just pray, basically. Stop doing this move! Bro. Hello? Well, 
Yeah, with Mater or Mater or whatever. Mater. Uh, yeah, I just have to pray, basically. Dead. <laughs> I fucking did it. I took a risk. <laughs> because I thought she had the bleed coming and I was right. Yeah, <laughs> let's fucking go. Nice! The great always wins! Let's go! 100 out of 100! <laughs> Shit, let's go! Um, also, chat, I have to confess something. <laughs> I did a quit out, but I this is now actually the second time I've beat her rune level one. <laughs> and I have to be honest because I think it's funny. <laughs> Now that the cre- now that is creepiness right there. Yeah, 100%. Yeah, so listen, chat story really fast. I wanted to practice her second phase because I was having a really hard time on Monday. So I was like, yeah, I'll just like practice dodging it. So I'll just do like R1s and I'll just like practice and stay alive. So I was doing this run. I'd literally been doing it for like 10 minutes. I was like, yeah, I just started. I was R1ing her. I was like, okay. I'll do like one more hit and then I'll be done. And then a frost proc went off and she died. I have never quit out of the game faster in my life. Cause I was like, no, 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 no. <laughs> Earlier I wanted to say, just do what you did before. Yeah. Well, yeah, I was like, oh my God. If, if, I couldn't show you guys my, like, physically show you guys my win. I would, it would make me want to cry. So humble, I know. <laughs> True, yeah. I was like, oh my god, I couldn't even believe it. I was like, yeah, I just want to practice, like, surviving. I'll just do R once. And then she fucking died. And I was like, <gasps> <laughs> yeah, so that was cool. <laughs> so now I've done it twice. How many people can say that? Me. <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah. So there's your story. Yeah. And I told Acton, I was like, I almost died. I freaking died inside. <laughs> I was like, all right, well, practice is over. I don't need to practice her, actually. So, yeah. Yeah. It was a cool thing. But let's go. Now that we have these runes, I'm going to go level up. Um, Cade, I swear to God. I'm going to go level up the Dragon Hunter's Katana so that we have it for when we try bail later. He <laughs> One, two, three, okay. Uh, oh, apparently I ended up with a lot more than I thought, but yeah, there's your fun facts. <laughs> Excuse me. And also, since I kind of only want to go to like 13, 14 for Shadow Blessings, now. Um, I don't think I'll fight Golden Hippo. I don't really need to. Okay, chat. I want to fight Putrescent Knight. Oh, man. Thinking about fighting Matera's ass. But you know what? The other thing I really want to do... I want to kill Queeline so I can get his Ash of War because I want to use that on the Shadow Fragment. And I think you only get it from killing him. You have, you can, do you have to kill him both times or just once? Because isn't that like the thrusting Ash of War? Because the first time you get a Talisman and then the second time you get his Ash of War, I think, but I could be wrong. I think it might it could be the opposite. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna do that. And then I should probably also talk to what's her face, Leda. 
about Hornsent and hope that it will trigger her wanting to murder him. I think that the invasion happens on the bridge before Mesmer. So I have to kill the Fire Knight there, I think. I could be wrong, but you know. Yeah, shut the hell up, Queen Line. Is Hippo a requirement for Horn Scent Invasion? I don't know. Actually, I'm dead. Fuck. By grace. I don't think it. Oh, if it is, then F, man. Then I might have to fight him, which is ass. I thought it was just like. If you go to Mesmer, here, actually, since I died, I'll... Just... Allow me some time. Hmm. Maybe it is a requirement. See, that's the thing is I don't know, because I meant to, during my mage run, I meant to do it. But... I, I messed up and I killed Mesmer because I have two brain cells and those brain cells are just used for murdering in bosses <laughs> those stripped of the grace of gold shall all be dead with the embrace of his first flame he sounds like such a fucking nerd let's kill him of Mesmer's flame. Quiline. All ye spurned by grace. Damn it. <laughs> Kneel evermore before the flame of Mesmer. Screw you, Quiline. Oh, I've died twice. I've died twice. I didn't count my Quiline deaths. Hi, Talos. How are you doing? Welcome in. I gotta, you know what? I probably don't need to, to use my golden vow. It's basically useless. Not to mention you just got marked by a dude with a, I got marked by a dude with a bull cut. Yeah, it's true, historical waifus. It's true, I did. It's so embarrassing, but it do be, it do be like that. Doing great, how about yourself? I am fabulous. We just beat Rolana. Just barely. I want to beat Quiline for future references, or like for future, or one of the bosses. Like I want his Ash of War. But um... I, I, okay, I dodged it. <laughs> Having fun getting kicked around the realm of shadow. You know what? I am. We've beat two remembrance bosses so far. I'm feeling pretty good. It's really fun. It's quite enjoyable. Uh, I really like the bosses in the DLC, so I'm, I'm having time. <laughs> I don't really need to do this. Also, I need to find out if I, maybe if I talk to Hornsent. What first? The impaired in vengeance for the how could I revenge Ugh, oh, you're gonna make me fight Hippopotamus. Uh, she's on a roll now. Yeah, I'm on a roll now. Maybe I don't want to kill Quilan. Maybe I want to try to get to Putrescence. Which one is more painful? Probably getting to Putrescence. Doing zero blessings to her or just RL1? Just RL1. 
I am currently at 12. I think I'm going to be done at 14. I could technically be done now, but I don't know why. 14 is just the number I've decided to land on. If it makes it feel as balanced as the base game, I'm not quite that in love with pain. <laughs> uh, I'm saying hippo is not a requirement for the summertime. Just don't get to Mesmer's door. Okay. Do you know when, at what point, she will start to be like, mm, I will kill him now. Do you know? Because cause the invasion is like on the bridge to Mesmer, right? Like we gank him before he gets there. More like poo essence, lol. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, getting to pure trestance at RL1 is awful. I am really scared, Talos. I'm so scared. I, man, I really wish I could keep having like, my first playthrough, Getting to Putrescence was so easy, and now it is insanely hard. And I don't know what the difference was between my first and second, like, playthroughs, but yeah, I, I'm afraid. FF14 mentioned. <gasps> oh my god, I'm not sure if she has to change her dialogue from what it is now. Oh, okay, we just have to, like invade we don't have to talk to her i mean i guess she probably wouldn't be like allow me some time to mull it over and then we sit down and stand back up and she goes you know what i changed my mind right in front of him so that's fair <laughs> maybe with the blessings you won't get one shot i did it with zero and his genuine pain bless you bless you yeah oops i did not change my sigic like i meant to i yeah no i couldn't i thought about it I thought about it uh, a little, a little bit. Um, I'll probably get one shot though, but I did think about it. And then I was like, no, cause I've watched other people do it. And I was like, yeah, I don't know if that's for me. <laughs> I like to at least have like, you know, maybe not just like hate my life totally and completely. <laughs> Okay, this is gonna be terrible. Here we go. I got, but I'm gonna get, I, he, how come all of a sudden, okay, I didn't get one shot, but um, um, yikers? Cade, bro, get down. I can't. I need total concentration and you to not be in my way. Thank you. <laughs> uh, let's see, baby. I did try. Oh, I did. Oh, let's see. I just hate myself. Lol. <laughs> hey, you know what? Props, though. Did you do the whole. Have you beat the run? Because genuinely. Assassin Gambit does help here, though, if needed. Oh, yeah, I do forget that's a thing. True. Yeah, our remembrance is done. Oh, my God. Giga Chad in chat. Stop. That's amazing. That's so cool. Rolana dead in five tries. Nobody thought this would happen. <laughs> Now they're able to, he, shit, 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 shit. Now they're able to shoot you right when you're in front of them. That was not a thing before. I just want everyone to know. <sighs> Dikers. <laughs> Stop it. Listen, that's not an easy feat, all right? I give you major points. <gasps> Where the hell do I go? What is the safer way? Probably just straight down the damn stairs. Jesus. 
just probably straight down the stairs. What am I doing? Bro. Hello? <laughs> this is... You know, I'm the queen of um running, but this is not just running. This is dodging. Hello? No. True. I'm dead. <laughs> I'm dead. <gasps> what? That timing was hell off. There was no way I was going to survive that one. Ha <laughs> ha. Hilarious. Goth <laughs> queen. Uh, also dark with the 83% feral. I have not checked my feral levels today. What do we got? Ooh, yikes. <laughs> Ooh, yikes. I wish I could just jump straight down to St. Trita. And also, I don't appreciate that there's like one bird following me. 42. Damn, we're on the calm side today. No. Yikes, 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 yikes. Don't drink the Sigic flask right there. That's terrible. Yep. Ha <laughs> ha. Hilarious. I should definitely put on... I still have my bubble. I gotta concentrate here. No! <laughs> yikes! Yikes, yikes, yikes. Oh, we made it. Okay, from here, this is so, so much more tolerable. Blessed be America. I don't know why I feel like I have to thank her, but I'm thanking her right now, all right? Whew. Oh, yeah, fuck those birds. Yeah, those birds. Beautiful, but like... We made it past the worst part. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Oh, you're not fair enough because you're near St. Trina. True. St. Trina's making me an EP bitch, Dark. All right. This part, more tolerable. I may be able to just run past. Yeah, because like... This guy. <laughs> I forgot. Imagine dying to a sludge. <laughs> or excuse me, imagine dying to putrescence. Yikes. Oops. Um, I should put this on. Okay. Oops. Also, you said it's been a calm hump day, Aries. Hell yeah, yeah. My day's been pretty chill. Rolled into me and dealt damage. Hilarious, I love this game. Ay, 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 ay. This guy is gonna kill me. Ugh. Yeah, 
Uh, easiest game of my life. And then he always falls down. Never have to fight him. Sweet, we're here. Cade, welcome back to the desk. Look at all these little EP animals. Yay, we made it! It's putrescence time. All right. Now... I don't feel like this is gonna be too bad. I liked my, I like putrescence as a fight, and I think that they're, um, I think that their fight is fairly easy. Putrescent is surprisingly fun. You ended up enjoying it quite a lot. Hell yeah. That makes me excited. Yeah, I think that the fight is pretty, pretty, pretty fun. It's not too bad. Going down. Whee! Turning, turning around. <laughs> you got this. Thank you, Talos. I, I can do it. I'm sure. Ads are starting right now. We're soon. So hopefully I'm not too giga Chad and kill him first try. That would be really weird. If I killed it this first try, I would start crying. Look at that shit. Look how pretty. I miss. Okay, noted. I'm not close enough? Ooh, yikes. The horse might actually kill me. Yo, is he so good? Oh, shit. I looked at- look at chat for half a second equals death. <laughs> the OST is super good. My sound is super low- the- my music is super- the music is super low, though? Why? <laughs> my bad. That is not on you. That is on me. <laughs> That is on me for looking. <laughs> I know better, but I do it anyway. Because I have no chill. Because <laughs> I'm greedy. We're really greedy in this house. <laughs> Commit to greed. Always. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Relatable, yeah. <laughs> That's how I beat Rolana. I beat her because of greed. Whee! Because I was like, I think she might bleed. So I hit her again and it could have been really bad. I'm waiting for one day when I do this jump and I die. <laughs> I think that would be really funny. Okay. I'm not close enough. Okay. Yikes, the horse! One, two, what the hell, bro? I'm dead. I'm dead because I was trying to drink equals dead. Greed pays off sometimes. It totally does. I especially felt that way with Rolana because she's so like, if I like, oops, sorry, Kate, I got your own fur like in your nose. If I sat around and waited for like proper and safe openings on R Rolana, I just would never kill her. <laughs> You think frost is good for putrescence? Actually, isn't putrescence? Hold on, aren't they weak to holy? Frost is probably not good for putrescence, but I'm pretty certain that they're weak to holy. I might have to double check that. P 
He's weak to holy, yeah. Is that right? Is it sacred? Sacred, yes? Where is? Holy, okay. <laughs> See how this works. Thank you. I have to remind myself, also immune to frost and bleed. And immune to... <laughs> Hilarious, okay. Good to know. <laughs> yeah, I... When I'm playing just like a normal game where I can level up and stuff, I don't think about what they're immune to, really. Because it doesn't really end up mattering, but in rune level one, it kind of matters. It matters. <laughs> immune to frostbite and bleed. How could a creature, an amalgamation of, of putrescence that is just bone and sludge, how could it be immune? I'm <laughs> just kidding. Anything immune to bleed, how dare. There goes my entire build. All right, bunny. What do I? I mean, sludge should be able to be frozen. Well, he probably. Would you stop for a second? Probably because they're like, oh, well, it uses frost, so it must be the... How did I not die? It must... I would like to hit you now. I'm dead. I misrolled that. Yeah, sludge should be able to be frosted, but because it uses frost, it's like, no. <laughs> no, you're not allowed to do that. Hey, you want to know an interesting theory I heard about the putrescence? Like, okay, so when I see putrescence, I think of, like, it's, like, multiple bodies in one, like, creature, right? And then the horse. But someone said that it's, like, a, like, um, like, the, the horse's bones and then, like, the, the creature on top is, like, riding the, the, does that make sense? Like, the bones are actually the horse's bones. Yeah, you saw that? I also heard the theory that I'm not with. I heard that people are saying that it's Radon's body, and I was like, what? That doesn't even make any sense. St. Trina has been down here for a gazillion years. <laughs> She's been down here forever. Radon only just got here like maybe a month ago, <laughs> or however long it takes us to get here. <laughs> Oh, noted. Okay. It is not Radon. Yeah. Yeah, I saw it. Because the reason I even knew <laughs> Radon's body is mush at this point. Yeah. Well, because, like, for me, I was like, what? That doesn't even make any sense. Because someone was, like, made, like, a troll post that was like, no, Putrescent Knight isn't Radon's body. It's Leonard. And I was like, what kind of cracked up theory is that? What is that? <laughs> but apparently people have been saying it. Which, like, isn't the weirdest theory I've heard, honestly. I mean, um, there's, there's, there's been, like, weirder theories out there. Because, like, we all know that at the end of the day, Mikola is everyone. Mikola is Putrescent Knight. Mikola is Melania. Mikola is Torrent. Mikola is us. We are Mikola. <laughs> Leonard is the only horse in the Elden Ring universe, apparently. Huh? What are the other horses? Oops. I mean, Leonard is the only important horse. Uh, except for this horse. This horse's name is... Um, uh... I don't know what this horse's name is. What the... I didn't know you could do a follow-up like that. I'm shocked that I lived. Oh, I'm dead. I keep forgetting there's two. Kind of have to relearn this. <laughs> I was being sarcastic. Full. <laughs> oh, yeah. The only one. Definitely. <laughs> well, he's the only one that matters. So. Yeah, I know. I saw that. I was like, what the hell? Listen. 
I'm all for like weird theories and stuff. Like I was reading about the whole like the Newmans are like aliens and these were like their ships. Right? Like I'm not super sold on that theory yet, but like I was like, oh interesting. Um but I'm more intrigued by that than being told that Kutras and Knight is actually just Verdon. That's silly. That doesn't even make any sense. It doesn't make any sense at all. Kutras and I has been here for a long ass time, and so has Saint Trina. Saint Trina's been down here for so long that she went from like having a whole body to turning into a damn eggplant. Alright? <laughs> like how we're torrent from the past. Yeah, exactly. We are. We're a torrent from the past. You hated this fight. I like this fight. It's kind of, it's a little scuffed. Oops. But like, it's fun. <laughs> what the fu Third. I can jump at it, right? One, two. Okay, that's greedy, but I can survive that. Oh. Huh? I think my spacing was just off. I hated it initially, but I like it now. That sounds like someone who did rune level one. <laughs> Stockholm Syndrome. We fight, we do the fight RL1 and then we love it. <laughs> That's me, yeah. I, you know, I liked D Divine Beast Dancing Lion and I thought it was fun, but I didn't like love it. But now that I've done it RL1, I'm like, that fight is lit. That fight is fun. I like it. And that's precisely what's going to happen with every fight in this game, pretty much. I went from, like, not liking, really, really liking Malakath fight because I always got destroyed to being like, I respect Malakath more than ever <laughs> after base game. Like, it changes you. Lightning phase can burn in hell, though. <laughs> Lightning phase is terrible. I can't even imagine. So I killed him during lightning phase because I greeted and then got really good RNG. <laughs> e, yikes. Um. Aw, oh, fuck. Damn it. Ah, why do I do that? Why am I the way that I am? <sighs> all four phases in the run I killed him on. Well, you also did it without Skadoosh fragments, so yeah, the phase would probably be super long. <laughs> it would probably be a lot longer fight than mine. Mine was like a minute long when I got the kill. <laughs> I got really, I greeted and I got good RNG. Because in the lightning phase, I decided to hit him um after he came onto the ground, like after he ch phased, and then he threw lightning at me. And that's the only reason I survived because he threw lightning at me. Yeah, the four phases, man, there's also like that one where he'll do like a phase change where it's like he does lightning and then wind and then frost and he'll do it like all at once, like he'll change and it's terrible. I've gotten that before, and that actually I've never survived in my life. One, you two. Yeah. What is going on with me? What is happening? Is Tracing, I don't think I've had that happen. Yeah, sometimes I don't know what triggers it, but sometimes, um, He'll go into like all three elements for some reason, and like it's really scary. Probably because Zero Skadoodle. Yeah, the Zero Skadoodle. I did kind of, yeah, I greeted on Lightning when I won, 
But like most of the time, <laughs> it was just like, oh my God, lightning round. Just avoid it and try to live. Just try to survive. And that was it. <laughs> just don't die. Don't do it. Don't perish. Oops. It's like longest drop ever. It's like longer than Madeir. Just don't get hit. Yeah, exactly. Just don't get hit. Easy. If you don't get hit, then you don't die. Okay. What is going on? Why do I keep getting hit by that all of a sudden? What is happening to me? <laughs> I... I am... I am getting washed up. All of a sudden I'm getting hit by that. I'm pretty certain it's my spacing is bad. I lost the no hit to the dumbest thing ever. Oh shit. Oh no. What did you lose it to? Game? Hello, Bega Mod Life. How are you doing? Let's go. Welcome back. Yes, pull up your popcorn. We have made it to Poo Poo Night. We have done it. Yeah. You know his head stomp where he stands up really high and then smashes his head down. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, no. No, I think I know where this is going. Okay, here we go. Uh -huh. Hilarious, I actually didn't hit him. I, oops. I'm trying, okay, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm really doing a horrible job, embarrassing. So normally you can run behind him and hit his butt, but in the wind phase he has an AOE behind him and I didn't know that, no, rip. I love all the animals waiting outside the spawn for this boss. Aren't they so? No! Talos, I'm so sorry. That sucks. Yeah, that AoE is a mon is monstrous. Look how wholesome and sweet they are. It would be a shame if people came here to farm them for their bones. I couldn't be bothered to redo it. That's super fair. <laughs> yeah, no hit. It, for me, no hit is just like, if I'm lucky and I don't get hit, I'll brag about it. But it wasn't skill, it was luck. But also brag. Um, but if I don't get it, then I can still be like, oh, I'm gonna brag because I won. <laughs> Basically me. <laughs> yeah, brag because win. Brag more because no damage. And I will feel that way for the rest of my life. All right, buddy. You little shit nugget. Woo! <laughs> I have to break this. What do you mean, bro? Okay, I've not seen that move, so I don't know what was going on with that. Yikers. <laughs> you get it, yeah. <laughs> I totally understand. We are in this together. <laughs> yeah, that's how I feel. I think... I'm actually not sure how many I've done, like, actually hitless, because I kind of put myself also thank you for the follow follows are anonymous so in lurk or chat either or it is up to you <laughs> um yeah i think of i, I like kind of set up my r01 run to be like i can actually take damage <laughs> 
<laughs> that wasn't me for sure. Yeah, no, totally not, Alums. <laughs> but maybe it was. I don't know. I mean, I can kiss. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I know I did Dancing Lion. Um, and then Melania, but on a fluke, bro. It was a fluke. I, I just got lucky. I, I, I feel like I did not really deserve that one. Because she didn't waterfowl in the second phase, and she didn't do a clone attack. With Melania? Yeah. <laughs> what? I pressed the button. It ate my input. Whatever. <laughs> it was my only no hit in the base game. I think it might have been my only no hit too. Oh my God, we're twins. After like 20 hours. Yeah, I spent a lot of time on her. The only other one. Oh no, I got hit once. I was going to say, I think maybe Commander O'Neill, but that's a lie. He actually hit me once. He popped my bubble at the very end. I fucking hate him. Twinsies, <laughs> how have I never met you till now? Separated at birth, you know? It happens. <laughs> yeah, who? Yeah, I don't think I did any other. Well, did I do Margit? No, I didn't do Margit because I didn't know that you couldn't use his shackle in his second phase, Morgant. I didn't know you couldn't use his shackle in his second phase. So he did the explosion and I was like, oh no, it's not working. <laughs> You've been missing out, Cat is the greatest. Oh my God. Oh my God, she's bragging about me. Oh, stop. Screw you! Uh, I'm dead. Huh? <laughs> okay, yeah. Can I? I'd love to hit you. I really would. I would. <laughs> and then what? What? what, 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 what? <laughs> And then what even was that hitbox? I got hit by his toes? Or it was Panda killed him twice, but it didn't count because I died at the same time. He talks too much. <laughs> no, that's horrible. I, I hate that. That feels bad when you die at the same time. It's always like a gamble. You're like, D especially because Morgoth dies so freaking slow. Some of the Remembrance bosses take forever to die. So if you die at the same time as them, it's just, it's over. <laughs> Happened to Mesmer too? That's pain. That's pain. I can't. Yikes. Yeah, I would probably cry. The only boss who almost made me cry was Commander Nile. I wanted to cry. I would have probably, I would want to cry too. I'm there. The only boss who actually made me cry was Commander, oh, almost made me cry. I lost 20 years of my life on that fight because I was parrying him and I messed up my parry. And, um, and then he killed me and he had one HP and I'm not even kidding. I almost started sobbing. <laughs> I was so sad. What the? Are you- what? No, as much as I love Impaling Thrust. Oh. I can greet that, Kay. I've noted that in my brain. horse. I'm dead. That was not fun. Straight up. <laughs> yeah. I learned to parry him because like, it was like the only way I could beat him. 
now I know his fight a lot better dodge wise, but I decided that parrying him was like the strat I was going to use, especially the fight. His fight is made so much worse by the fact that you have to kill. Like in R01 especially, I feel like you have to kill the summons. And like, yeah, it was horrible. I almost cried. <laughs> and then I beat him like right after that. And then I almost cried because I won. And I actually almost made the same mistake. Because <laughs> he popped my bubble because I parried late. And then I was like, don't greed, don't do it. Because then I was going to quit. I actually, I'm glad I didn't. But I actually tried to like glitch him like so I didn't have to fight him and I couldn't I couldn't get the glitch to work oops yep that's on me too slow I could not get the glitch to work I wish I didn't suck at this fight I, I thought I would do a little better I didn't think it would be so bad but it's a little bit tougher than... Uh, yeah, you did it, though. Yeah, I did it, though. I was like, you know what? I can't get the glitches or the skips to work, so I'll just do it for real. <laughs> it was horrible. but It was definitely my least favorite boss fight. And it did not make me respect him. It just made me hate him more. So now whenever I go back there, I'm like, screw you, Nile, I freaking hate you. And then it's a bet. And then it's, like, always scuffed because I'm greedy because I hate him. <laughs> Yeah, no, nah, fuck him. I hate him. <laughs> I hate him so much. He's so horrid. All my homies hate Commander O'Neill. He sucks. Both of them. They can kick rocks. <laughs> fights with ads. Ooh, which, speaking of fights with ads, I'm scared of Jory. Uh oh, I'm dead. <laughs> I know... I need to stop trying to use my Ash of War. That's it. I need to stop. I need to stop using my Ash of War. Because it's just like... Me being a dingus. Elder Spammer, aka Elder Garbage. Yeah. It's like, summons Big Chungus and I'm scared. I was actually gonna check. What is this one? Is this... Golden Bow? I could use Crag Blade. He doesn't stop summoning. Yeah, he's horrible. I am hoping that I can... Um... Like, kill him before he starts summoning. <laughs> that I have enough damage for that, because that would be epic. I would love that. Oops, minus one actually done yeah you can backstab him to death which is cool yeah i heard you can chain attack him but i've like never actually like seen it done but i'd be curious to see it because i've seen people fight him run level one but not with the chain backstab here we go I kind of did a scuffed version of it with Starfist. Hell yeah, I love that. What the? Okay. Oh, wait, heal. Don't. What are you doing? Backstab plus staggers, yeah. Oh! I'm alive? I'm dead. I'm alive? Oh, I missed time that. <laughs> okay. Let me put on the, um... Jumping talisman. I want to try some jumps because you can jump over some of his attacks. She's alive. I am shocked that I lived. 
Yeah, let me actually put this on and then put on this. Yeah, let's do that. I can get a tiny tear. Do you want to figure everything out on your own? Um, for now, I'll keep kind of trying to find out on my own. But at some point, if I get frustrated, I will let you know if I'd like help. I love pain. <laughs> Thank you, though. And I appreciate you asking. Kate is here being moral support. Technically, Loki is too, but Kate is, like, directly here in front of me. All right. Uh oh, <laughs> that was stupid. Why do we keep doing that? Whatever. Whatever. Look how cool. God, I love this boss. <gasps> I am enjoying myself, but I wish I could stop throwing. Me. This boss should it be bad. Also me. Can't even get to second base. It's fine. You know what, though? It took me way less time to get here than I thought it would. I thought we were going to be stuck for like an hour trying to get here. So we're already making great time. <laughs> we're making great time already. Wee. Hiya. Going down. I feel like by the time I land here... I should probably just, like, buff when I'm in the arena. I have time. I need to dodge this way. Uh-oh. I did it again! Why do we keep doing that? <laughs> Hell yeah, speedrun world record pace. Why do I keep doing this? Why am I the way that I am? I literally told myself last time, I just died to that and then I died to it again. When will I learn? Yeah, I'm a professional runner because you're cool. Thank you, Aries. I tried to be cool, but there was a piece of fur in my face, so I couldn't be as cool as I was hoping to be. Wee. Yeah, I can do this. I can drink both my flasks and buff, right? Let's test it. If I die, then I guess I know my answer. But whatever. Let's do this. Oh yeah, there's time. <laughs> Damn, I I rolled super duper like early or late. I I'm not even sure. I just did bad. Recognizing your mistakes and still doing it is like the definitive R1 experience. Yeah, like don't do that. Stop doing that. Why are you doing that? And then proceeds to do it again. <laughs> It's the greed in me. The greed in me is like, yes, I know I shouldn't do that. But I could do it again. <laughs> I could do it again. <laughs> Fucking watch me do it again. I can't. Okay, can't. Figure, figure it out. Maybe this time it'll work. Yeah, <laughs> maybe this time I won't die. Even though I died like 20 other times doing that thing. Yes. This is the one. You shit nugget. Huh? I keep trying to go on his, or like I keep trying to go to like the left, but then I end up and the on the right or on what it'd be hit his his left keep trying to go to their right but i keep 
not ending up there. Stop blocking that spot. I'm begging you. Saint Trina. I definitely feel like I don't have as many. I do. What am I saying? I was gonna say, I feel like I don't have as many thrusting opportunities. That's why I changed it. But I think I do. I think I'm just being a dingus. Whatever. It doesn't matter. I will get it. Right now. Full concentration. Th Thrusting opportunities. <laughs> I didn't dodge! After I press the dodge button. <laughs> Thrusting opportunities. Gotta keep stabbing him. True, Asir. Oh, Elden Ring. Also true. How are you doing? It is good to see you. Um, maybe I go back to thrust <laughs> thrusting. <laughs> I'm just kind of addicted to being able to like do that because that's pretty fun. Man, you know what though? You know what's probably making this more difficult for me is the fact that this guy can't bleed and cannot be frosted. And because of that, now I have to actually rely on my skill and not on the procs to save my life. Uh -huh. Hilarious. Imagine relying on your skills to win. I'm doing great just doing Golden Etrusty tonight for some souls. Hell yeah, I love that for you. Addicted to thrust, yeah. I wanted to do this RL1 with, an, with a DLC weapon. DLC with DLC weapon. And this is the one I've decided I want to use, because I like it a lot. It's very powerful. What the? What was that, bro? He got, the horse got stuck behind the knight and like totally threw off the, the my roll because I was confused. <laughs> RL1 Karate Cat. Yeah, imagine doing fists for RL1. Holy shit, that would be horrible. The most powerful part of the, the like the dry leaf arts is the Ash of War. That you need freaking hyper armor and health for. <laughs> gonna use it for every boss? Maybe. I mean, I'm gonna use the dragon katana for Bale. There's a high probability I'll be using this for pretty much every boss. I am not sure about Mr. Consort. Um, I may end up using a different weapon. Yikes. Uh, for, but like, the, I've seen that the clean rot, I mean, obviously we could probably use Ansper Rapier if I get the right kind of talismans. Okay, what are you doing? Um, but clean rot knight sword is also a good choice for that too, because it's fast and it's a thrust, like a thrust. Adonis pain. I believe it. <gasps> Cat tree right now. Oh my god, Cade. You're gonna get what you wanted. Yeah, that's why he's here. Ansper is uh, the go. It really is. Oops, that might be one too many. Sorry. Look up. You're, you're such a dingus. <laughs> Ansper is how I beat him the first time. Um, with a giant shield, but it's different in the DLC. You, have to have you can't just hide behind a shield. You have to... 
he's left the desk. You have to take it seriously and you you have to like actually dodge or parry or something and like the pain is Im immense. I killed him with Ansper without the shield. Yeah. That is definitely one of the options I am considering. I might try with Great Katana just in case, you know, cuz like I, I want to see how it feels, but it might be a little too slow. And the other problem, too, is that it is quite heavy, especially when I'm using the the, the two-handed talisman. Um, yeah. And I want... I'm gonna want to be... light roll for that. Especially for the double cross slash. What the fuck was that? What was I just doing? What was my character just doing? <laughs> he just like stood there. Love that. Bleed and rise a killer combo. It really is. Especially on Mr. Radon. Who we love and adore. I asked him if he wanted to be my consort, but he said... That's what he said. Yeah. Which was kind of cute. You know, I'm, I'm chill. Shy people. Not sure about love or adore. <laughs> I do. I like him. I just did my first mage run. And, um... I did my first mage run, and, um, that was holy test of abilities. And not even, I fucked up, not even rune level one. You know, I'm supposed to have good reach. When will I learn, bro? <laughs> never. She will never. Yeah, but anyway, when I did my mage run, I was like, wow, Verdant's actually like... I mean, I mean, I think it's fun. I personally still think Melania is harder. Because Radon's fight... The only reason it's really difficult is because it's fucking scuffed. <laughs> like, because of the trenches and, like, the cross slash, which is BS, by the way. Because other than that, it's really not that bad. Like, the moveset isn't really hard. It's just, like, when you combine, like, Mikola hair with, like... It's as soon as Mikola gets into the fight, it's just because it's it's only hard because it's scuffed. Uh oh. have a run going. I don't even have the right talismans on right now. I messed up. That was on me. Hey, but great. That's the farthest we've gotten. And his hitboxes, yeah. Because the cross slash, like, none of his moves are that hard, but, like, that cross slash is one thing. Like, it's kind of dumb that, like, you can't really dodge it well unless you're, like, frame perfect or light rolling or even heavy rolling. Like, mid rolling, that sucks so bad. 
I just encountered something I knew I've never seen before. Someone entered Radon's arena and he auto went into phase two with full HP. Damn. See, and that's the other thing. Bro is bugged out of his mind. <laughs> Bro is bugged out of his mind. Like, people will walk into the arena and he will just die or like he falls through the floor. Like, I love Radon. <laughs> uh, you're in front of the leg, just some tech. No reason a regular ass combo should be that hard to avoid. Yeah, exactly. Like, if I dodge into his peony at the right time, I should make it, okay? And I do dodge at the right time. It's just that his hitbox is dumb. <laughs> I'm dead. I'm alive. What? I'm a, I'm a, I'm a. <laughs> what is happening? Hilarious. I'm concentrating, I'm concentrating. Ugh. That was greed and I paid for it. I didn't die, but I paid for it. What? <laughs> uh, yikes, I didn't die. He is bugged out his mind, but for my attempts, he wanted to lock in and fight like a, he slaughtered his horse. I might have, like I slaughtered his horse. I might have on accident. Oopsie. Uh-oh. <laughs> Man is mad because I accidentally killed his horse. What was I supposed to do? He was riding the horse. If, if Leonard got caught in the crossfire, that's not on me. That's on him for putting his horse in danger. Yeah, I had a rough time. I do feel like I really learned a lot more doing my mage run because obviously I forced myself to like, you know, be a mage and no shields, which was like his own thing. And turns out he's got so many freaking openings because I was able to cast freaking rain of stars on him <laughs> all the time. 
And like my dex was not even like that great. I still got hit by that. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead because I did the same thing I keep doing. <laughs> Hilarious. <laughs> Which is doing that when I know I shouldn't. Anyway, mage runs are fun because magic is so strong. Yeah, so I've never done any magic runs before. And my last run before this one was my first sorcery run, base game and DLC. I did every Remembrance boss except for Rykard because... He's a gimmick boss, so it doesn't really feel like... I don't wanna. <laughs> I don't wanna paint through that. But like, man, I was like, yeah, I think like Reign of Stars is pretty mid, and then it was my favorite spell, and I couldn't stop using it. And I kill, I used it to kill everything, because it, it was so fun and so good and so interesting. <laughs> <laughs> Because I'm always like a strength user, pretty much. Like, I always use strength builds. I have a problem. Oh, yikes. Oh, yikes. I was sprinting. I was trying to sprint away, and then he went into that so I'm, that was just a base strength enjoyer, yeah. I was like, yeah, so it was a challenge run for me to do a mage build because I'd never done anything like that before. I, like, there were so many things I didn't even know <laughs> and, like, things, like, I've, I've put a lot of hours into this game, like, probably a thousand at this point, and, like, I was like, wait, that's a thing? <laughs> Like, where is that? And I didn't use a single Starlight Shard the entire run. And then forgot about- and then got reminded about them, and then forgot about them again. Because I have no chill. Um... <laughs> I love strength. I love bonking everything to death. It's really fun. I would like to bonk this guy to death, um, but I'm having a time doing that. I even have the right thing on. One and a two. One, two. One, two. Get rusted on. Dead. I'm dead. I'm alive. I'm dead. Oh, he yikes. Okay. Yikers. Bonk is live. True. I love bonk builds. They're the best. They're goaded. They are crazy. They are fun. I love them. She went through bonking withdrawals for sure. I did. There was like a point like halfway through the mage run. I was like, man, I really wish I had a giant sword right now because I only use sorceries. Like I didn't use anything else. I just use sorceries. In the times I was just like, bro, I just want to use a big sword again. I, it happened a couple times so I was like man I just miss <laughs> I just miss it so much <laughs> my little heart was hurting I was definitely having some withdrawals the rehab did not work very well although you know what that's a lie it did kind of work because it made me interested in doing other runs like a faith incantation only run and um 
like a, maybe like a crucible only run, like a crucible night run or something. That would be fun. Like it made me interested in other types of runs. <laughs> I was... I'm dead. Why did I do that? <laughs> Hilarious. <laughs> it's gonna be okay. I will. I'm trying. <laughs> Ninety-five percent feral. Damn, Acton. You just like showed everybody up. You're a feral AF. Chat. I'm doing really bad. Um. I actually did not think this was gonna be so Get bad, down! but this is on me. Yeah, see, true. This is all on me. This is all just me. <laughs> I need to, first, it's, this is 100% me and not the boss. Like I'm just doing a bad job and I keep doing stupid shit. <laughs> That's giving me kill. Why am I the way that I am? Hmm? Okay. Yeah, we gotta get good. Aesir, you're all right. Stop dying, start getting good. Right now, I'm doing it right now. Shoot. I'm gonna get good right now. really close right up to him what the fuck was that yes see okay so it takes four get him oh shit okay Here we go. Oh! I mistimed the jump, yikes. Well, there's my new PB, at least. So in order for me to get him down, I have to get like four consecutive bombs. Um. Yikers. <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, I'll, I'll just keep using this. What? What is it even going to hurt? Do I have anything that boosts holy damage? Question mark? Or is that enough? No. Oh, I don't have that scorpion talisman doesn't really matter that much it's all right i think what i have is fine i have the dumb version of alexander uh, i killed alexander early i did i made a lot of mistakes chat i killed alexander early i killed bogart for his balls and never got the shrimp like this is what i get this is what i get no oh, yeah I have to deal with the consequences of my actions. I originally was doing the RL1 run with just the round ball, so I killed Bogart early. Never do that, chat. Never kill him, ever. It's not worth it. Just use Starfist instead. Super not worth it. Yikes, I wasn't close enough. <laughs> yeah, that was, that was. Yeah, I've made mistakes. But you know what? Starfists are basically an upgrade anyway. Yeah, Starfists are way better. I just, you know, listen, this is my character. I'm Giga Chat, right? I wanted to 
pissed everything to death because haha, it's funny. And to be fair, the iron balls are very good. They're very fun. They're hee hee ha ha. They're and they're also a good weapon. But Starfist is just so much better. And yeah. When I did this run, it was like over a year ago when I started it. And like I hadn't played the game in like six months. That don't don't be like that. <laughs> I was like, yeah, I could do it. I was good at the game. And then I came back and started R01. And I ended up actually taking a break from it. And then when I came back, I was like a god gamer. So then I was good to go. But like, because I wasn't a god gamer before, I made a lot of mistakes that I shouldn't have made. <laughs> like killing Foghart. Or getting hit, smacked by this horse. What in the hell was that? Okay. It's okay. We all make mistakes. They do be hee hee ha ha. Yeah. I mean, and they were fun. They are. They are fun. I I beat a good chunk of bosses with them. But you know, we live and we learn, and then we use the same save file. So, what? No, what can you do? Nothing. You just get good, and live with the consequences of your actions. slowly falling slowly falling falling forever falling forever okay here we go you know what i have at least it's nice i have this long drop to think about how i'm gonna do the same thing that i just did and not learn from my last run uh -huh. it's a good fall i i hello going on here? He's pulling a Rolana. Hilarious. <gasps> Ugh! He did the quick one too. I wasn't ready for that. Poor host, I just got some help. He jumped too short and swan dived into a large pool of water, cave water and died. Rip. <laughs> Rip host. Damn. That's such a terrible feeling. <laughs> Time well spent. Hell yeah, it is. Yeah. You know what I'm interested? I am super curious about how Convergence mod is going to handle the DLC. I'm probably not going to play it for a while because I want like a lot more updates before I play it again. But I'm curious what they're going to do because this DLC is just like so jam packed with stuff already. Like what more are they going to add or like what are they going to change, you know? And uh, I am curious. And there are other bosses they've added already that like I haven't tried that I'd like to go back and try. Also, how about randomizer? Can DLC bosses be in regular game? Oh, see, I don't know that, but I do think the randomizer is ready now, I think. I've never tried the mod, but I want to. Yeah, it's fun. I really liked it. It was time well spent. What? I dodged, brother. Okay, whatever. Yeah, I did a, th a thorn build and they made like a, they literally made like the chicken leg before the chicken leg came out. 
like the bleeding chicken leg. Um, and that was like what I used with like some thorn sorceries and it was so fun. It was ridiculous. I really liked that run. I had a lot of fun with that one. And they made Castle Morn insane. Insanely fun. <laughs> I'm always impressed by the modding community and like what they can do. It's really, really cool. I actually kind of want to like, they made that convergence for Dark Souls 3 and it's now like, like they're not going to be updating it anymore. It's like completed. So that'd be kind of fun to try that one. I would like to play Dark Souls 3 again. I'm dead. Heal equals death. Fogwall randomizer would be pretty funny. Uh, yeah, that's also, you should do that after this RL1. No. <laughs> after RL1, I'm playing Bloodborne now that I have a PlayStation. Thanks to you guys. Thank you. And we're probably gonna play some, we're gonna, my plan is Bloodborne. And if it goes well, I would like to try a BL4 when the game is like fresh, right? And then I want to play Stellar Blade and God of War Ragnarok. That's kind of like the plan right now. Like once this run is over, we're moving on to the PlayStation. You pronounce R01 fog random wall randomizer wrong. Sounded like you said Bloodborne. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, I definitely kind of want to take a break from Elden Ring after this, for a little bit, at least. Because as much as I love this game, I've been playing it for like months and months and months and months and months. <laughs> I'm pretty much, I am my, what the fuck? Okay, my channel says I'm a variety streamer, but I've been playing Elden Ring for like six months. Much. It feels like I've been playing it forever. I'm gonna play Stellar Blade so bad, right? Talos, it looks so good. Actually, I have seen like or someone play it. I watched someone play it, which is why I wanna play it so bad. And like, so, you know, I've been pretty much spoiled cause I was like willing, but that's because the game was so good. I was so like, entranced in watching this playthrough because I was like, this game is so cool. It's so fun. And not just because of the ass, okay? It's also got a really interesting plot. The plot in question? I have nothing to say about that. But also, you can pick up fashion everywhere and the, the like, like, the combat is legitimately very cool. Okay, but ass is nice. Ass is nice, yeah. And you can do fat, there's like fashion and like, yeah, it's great. I love fashion. <laughs> I would love, I would love you to stop running. Give me, I'm alive. Uh oh. Uh oh, I'm dead. Cause I never learn! Cause I never learn! Whatever. <laughs> I too like being pretty, yes. <laughs> Guys, when will I learn? When will you learn that your accents have consequences? When will you learn that that move after that combo, the combo is not over? She never learns. God, I'm also in pain, you guys. Don't, I'm in pain for you. Anyway. Yikes. Whee. 
Yeah, but the the combat is really cool, and like I just love the combat, and like it just looks really fun. So I'm definitely that's on the list. But we also have like Demon Souls to play too. I would like to play Demon Souls. Super scuffed, but like it seems fun. Oh, I missed. Okay, yeah. When will I learn? Never. I'm dead because I had no stamina. <laughs> uh, it also has very near Automata vibes. Yeah, I've never played near Automata. It's on like my list. I don't own it yet, but it is on my list of a game I'd like to try. Because I feel like, listen, I love Bayonetta 1 and 2. A lot. And I feel like Bayonetta, Nier Automata, and then like Stellar Blade is like the holy trinity of like those type of games, you know, like super hot babes fighting weird shit. Like <laughs> <laughs> I like Nier Automata. I like the what is her name? 2B. I love her design. Cute. What? Yeah, I've never played it before. It is on my list, though. I would like to try it at some point. Because it does seem like it would be fun. Good music, good story, good booty. Which, at the end of the day, that's all... What more is there to ask for? <laughs> good story is, like, the most important thing. Good music... Even better. Good gameplay. Even better. Ass? I'll take it. Everyone loves a good ass. And anyone who says that they don't is a liar. I missed. See? <laughs> Hilarious. <laughs> but like... Ah! What's happening? Why didn't I punish that? Oh, thank you. That, this weapon is a little too slow to punish right there, so. McMahone meme JPEG. That's not a link, please no ban. No, it's okay, trust me. And even if it was a link, you get timed off for one second, it's not a big deal. <laughs> it's just to prevent the bots from pretending like they can come in here. And be like, best viewers on Twitch. No. <laughs> okay, one second is fine. <laughs> yeah. What if I was not a bot, though? Then I would be like, what are you posting? <laughs> what is this? Hmm? And then you would tell me. And then I'd be like, oh, cool. And, that, and that's pretty much it. <laughs> oh, what if you were a bot, though? Well, I'm an AI, so... I read your comment wrong first time anyway i'm actually an ai though so no way yeah i know ai is getting pretty uh, complex now these days you know wild stuff mm -hmm. pretty much yeah yeah 
actually, I don't think an AI could be as cool of a gamer as me. Mm, I'll make rules. Okay, so I can do it. out of me <laughs> i almost my life legit just flashed before my eyes there oh my god stop <laughs> I was so close to it. I'm dead. Because I did the thing again. <laughs> no way. These VTubers are getting out of hand, right? Like, look at this. This is like crazy. The rigging? Impeccable. Oh my god. These VTubers are wild. They are crazy. They look just like people. Clean dodges, though. Yeah. Those are some clean dodges, but I did the same thing that has been killing me. I... I attacked. I keep acting like this weapon is faster than it is on this boss for some reason. Like, I know it's not, but on this boss, I'm like, yes, yeah, an opening, and I take it, and then I perish for it, but it's all right. Yeah, progress. Those are some clean dodges, much better than some of the dodges have been. For some reason, there was a point at the beginning of this where, like, I could not dodge, like, the... You know, the one, the, the tornado horse thing. I don't even know what to call that move. Tornado horse, yeah. He's just a tornado horse. Here we go. For real this time. Don't be dumb. I dodged the wrong way. You got this. Thank you, Rekka. I see you. I hope you're having a good Wednesday. Very nice. Which move is a tornado horse? The one where he, like, you know, jumps in the air and then, like, the horse comes at me. Tornado horse. I don't really know what to call it. <laughs> that one, yeah. I don't know if it has an actual name or not. <laughs> but that's my name for it. This move. Tornado horse. I'm dead. Yeah, that makes sense. So it turns out that this actually has, like, timing to it. <laughs> uh, and then there's, like, a piece of fur in my eye. <laughs> Living with cats, you never know when a piece of hair is just going to, like, float into your... Well, and sometimes I feel like... Like, it, it's definitely a me thing, but I didn't know it was a me thing until now, because, well, until rune level one, because before I didn't really worry about this, but, like, I have to make sure the spacing is right or he'll land right on top of me, which I've never really thought about before. So, that's important. We must do it right. It dodged on, nerd. It's time to die.
wrong way. Okay, interesting. I I would love to hit you. Okay, that's fine. Cool. Yeah. Or maybe not. Oh yeah, okay, yeah. There we go. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you know what? I just realized I get to give myself a second to breathe. I should change my stream title so that it's not Rolana. Q. How, how do I? My internet died for a second there. Well, I totally won. <laughs> That's weird. So did mine. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know what happened. I just, I, something happened, um, my internet too. So then I, I got teleported back to the gray. Uh. Saint Trina calls us now. So then it's not really spoilery. <laughs> oh, so it wasn't me. Phew. Ah, uh, you're across the country. I guess it was Kat. Yeah, it probably was. It was me. <sighs> There's a freaking piece of fur in my eye. Yeah, it says I dropped frames for a second, so... Oh, I get it now. <laughs> I mean, but really, it actually says that I dropped frames, so it, it could have been me. For real. Unless we're actually just memeing, then yeah, it was me anyway. Hey, yeah, <laughs> I was like, how did all our internets go out? <laughs> Hair in the eye is not very optimal. It's not. And there's like a, I think I got it though. Man, why can't you bleed? Let me bleed you. Let me do it now. I really have to try to be on this. <laughs> Tornado horse. What? Huh? I dodge, I swear. I dodge, I swear. It looks like it's gonna rain outside. We've been getting some rain in the last couple of weeks, which is like, great. Cause it's been so hot and dry and so hot, so hot. We go again. Yeah. Na -na -na -na. Yeah, stream elements, I should. I should probably. I mean, I'm not even frustrated with this fight at all, so I don't even feel like I need to break. <laughs> if I'm enjoying a fight, and honestly, I am enjoying this fight, I'm doing a horrible job, but I like this fight a lot. So I don't really feel like I need to break. It's not even frying my brain. I'm just being... Maybe I use all my willpower on Rowana today. No! Learn. Yes. Learn. Yes. Yes! Learn! One. Two. Yep. One. One, two, and do it. Bonk. Nice. I 
I'm dead. I'm dead because I didn't learn. <laughs> Literally, I did it perfectly like three times and then I graded. <laughs> learn! When will she learn? Oh my god. Hello? It is not a break. It is drinking some liquid. All right, I will drink some. Well, it says you might as well stand up too and get some movement in. I don't need to move. I need to just sit here. Can you sit here? I need to think about seeing as how you never stand up to move. Because I don't want to. I don't want to move. I already got my exercise in for the day. Now I would like to do nothing. <laughs> but beat the this is my exercise. You know, my watch was like... Congratulations, you hit your goal, your your workout goal, because sometimes this game makes my heart race, so it counts towards working out. I did it. <laughs> hit my goal. <laughs> Need a heart rate monitor? Honestly, I probably could set one up, because I have a Fitbit. And you guys would see the moments when I'm actually, like, upset. Ah! Learn! Learn. Oh my lord. Learn? Yeah, nice. Get to learning. I'm so dead. Yikes. I thought that he was doing the one in front of him. Yep. Damn, that sucked. Oh well. Okay, I've got this. <laughs> you know, classic in classic Shasta fashion. She gets him to one hit and then dies. It is the law. That happens to me pretty much every time I do anything. <laughs> what a terrible habit to get into, by the way. I actually think I was doing that hit this too. Shasta showing and growing again. I know. I'm so embarrassed. I'm so embarrassed I didn't even do the follow-up. Thank you for letting me do that. Okay. It's like a butt tunnel. It's like a butt tunnel. Sure. There is... I have a ditch on my nose. Please help. Man, that was rough. I not believe that. And then I mistimed that, yeah. <laughs> it was like a mud tunnel. Oh my god, I can't believe I fucking threw! <laughs>
I'm so devastated. You know what? If there's a boss I'm gonna throw on, I might as well make it this one. You know, for the for the uh, for the content. For the content. Plenty of throwing yet to come. Yeah. Fear not. I have so much time and so many bosses to just do this on. <laughs> I have a feeling I'm gonna do it on Mesmer and I'm gonna do it on Radon for sure. Like there's just like no way I'm not. Afraid. I hate when bosses just start standing there. It is so freaking stressful. Because I'm like, should I hit you now or what? <laughs> okay, here we go. Hello? What? Whatever. He's just standing there menacingly. Yeah. I hate when they do that. And I feel like it only happens when I'm doing rune level one. Where like all of a sudden they'll just stand there. And they'll just stand there and like look at me. And I'm like, will you, will you do something? Because I, I can't attack you until you attack me. Because I, I need to wait for an opening. Because if I don't. And like I just attack, then I can, I will die. <laughs> I kind of took that risk more on Rolana, but Rolana was a risk it for the biscuit, you know? Like you just kind of have to do it. <laughs> you just have to. It is just a lot. All right. True, true, yeah. But I noticed that there's some people who be like, the bosses have no openings. I'm like, what do you mean? When I do rune level one, they just stand there, bro. <laughs> it's like they know. Ooh, yikes, I almost died. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Why did I do that? I'm fine. Let 
me let me heal. See, that's what I'm talking about. That's the one I that I thought he was doing, and so I died. Fuck me, bro. All right. Enough! <laughs> bro. That's twice that I've just thrown. I, 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 I. All right, chat. I've had enough. No more content. I just, I'm going to win. So close, yeah. I was like, all right, he's gonna do a move and then I can just thrust and it'll be over. And then he did that instead. Oh well, it happens. It happens. I mean, it literally just happened like not even 20 minutes ago. So we'll just do it again. I actually got the move set down. This boss fight is actually really fun. This has been fun. And actually, in comparison to Renala, this feels very chill. Like, I'm like, yeah, nice. This is nice. <laughs> Even though I've died to some scuff, but like, whatever. Poke. Do the thing. Yeah, do the thing. Yeah, she's downloaded. It's over. Don't throw, cat. I will throw up. <laughs> what? I missed? I'm not even sure how I missed. love when I miss. Fine. What? I got hit. I got hit. Usually if I get bonked by that, I die, but I didn't that time. And then he nade, and then I died to nade. Imagine dying to nade. 
That move sucked, PP. Yeah, that move sucked. A down slam into Nay? Nay, Nay. Huh? Well, we go again. <laughs> any any time now will be the time. I just gotta get good. I just have to do it. Do you think putting on the faith talisman will make my sword stronger? Here, any time now will be the time. Yeah, Derek, it's true. I actually threw twice and he had one hit left twice. How are you doing, <laughs> by the way? It's good to see you. The faith talisman that like boosts your faith. Um, like your faith stat. Just cause it's sacred, will that boost my damage or not? <laughs> almost died. Probably better off using Scorpion Charm. Yeah, he's gonna do it now. Okay. Ugh. <laughs> Don't grieve. Does this button work now? <laughs> this button doesn't work. Apparently. Doing great, I hate this boss so much. <gasps> you do? Everyone hates this boss. I love this boss. <laughs> uh, let's see, maybe a bit. Scorpion Charm is probably better, yeah. Scorpion Charm is probably better. I mean, I love this boss. I, everyone keeps saying that. I, I like this boss so much. I think it's... I mean, I can understand why people don't like it. You know, I understand why people don't like it. So, I, no no shame to you. Because I, I get it. I get it. Eh, it boosts it like a, by like a hundred. I don't know if that's... Worth it. I love it when he jumps off the horse in Rex shop. The horse tornado? <laughs> we call that the horse tornado now. It's the new name. <laughs> 7 to 12, 14, yeah. D is that worth it? I mean, I guess it would be, huh? I just, I don't know. I don't know. It might be better to do just like the talisman that raises my, what am I doing? What is she doing? It might be better to do the talisman that raises my damage when my health is full. Or Snado, precisely, Derek. <laughs> uh, hold on, let me look. Let me look at this. <gasps> oh my god, it boosts it heavily. Okay, we're putting on the faith talisman. I don't make the rules. <laughs> That's not even 5%. Yeah, probably not worth it. Well, wait, the, doesn't isn't this supposed to boost my damage? Why can't I not see it on the status? Am I blind? Or wait, is this is the defense one? I'm fucking dumb. Raises defense. What am I doing? <laughs> I don't even have that one. Why? What? 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 What, what am I doing? Yeah, it's not worth it. Anyway, I don't. I don't know what I'm thinking. I think my. I think I'm losing it. My brain is fried. That's not a damage talisman. <laughs> it's so over. Happens to the best of us. Yeah, not really worth it. I'd rather hold on to this and like, have that negation instead. Although honestly, I should be doing this without getting hit, but that's just, I should do this hitless. <laughs> that's how good I am in the game. Oh. Or 
I uh, could just die immediately. You can do a hit list, yeah. I actually think there was the one where he had like literally like 20 HP. I think I was doing that one hitless. And then I died. And I actually think I was doing the other one hitless as well. No, no, no. I don't. I think I got hit. I don't know. I'm sure I can do it. Longest fall ever. I don't know why I'm making a race car sound. Technically, that run was hitless. Technically, yeah. Hitless on Putrescent's end, <laughs> you did not hit the box. Why do I keep pretending like I can do that? Fuck you. Okay, noted. That move is so funny because it's actually the same as like the fast one too. But he just delays it. So I just dodge it the same way I would the one two. Oh, plunk. Um, stop. Okay, or don't. Let me heal. Or don't. That's fine. <laughs> I don't even know why I bother. Because it doesn't matter. It's not like I'm doing more damage when I have full health. Hmm. Anyway. Soon, like right now, it's over. I've had, I've had it. So I've decided that right now I'm gonna win. And the run doesn't count if I don't swing my sword on the way down. So I make this funny little move when I'm jumping. It's funny. Sick. All right, here we go. This is the actual run. This is the real run. No more practicing. Okay. I was a little bit too far away from him when I did that. If I am like spaced correctly, when he throws the second time and then swings over top of me, he doesn't hit me. It was not the run. No. <laughs> she said it was the run, but it was not, in fact, the run. Look at these little faces. They're so silly. I've never really looked at these before. Very neat. That's nice. Very cool. Very cool. Um. Going down. Yeah. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> 
never actually really looked at those that hard, I guess. They need to be looked at again. Oh shit, minus one. I mean, it doesn't really matter. <laughs> Poke. Okay, here we go. This is serious business now. And a dodge. And a dodge again. And a dodge. Just for safety, dodge. 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 Right. And thrust. Again. Same. Yeah. I mean, I know there's, like, the ox head on, like, the front, but... One. One. Two. <laughs> That was a pause. One. Oh, no, not far enough. Give me another move. I'm sick of this move. There we go. Thrust. One, two. One, two, get him. Here it goes. I got it. I Huh? I feel like that came at me so late. Whatever. Stop hitting me. I'm dead. Did you ever upgrade great dragon katana with Rolana's runes? I did. It was the first thing I did after she died. So it is ready. Well, I need an ancient dragon smithing stone if I really want to, like, capitalize on its greatness, but, yeah. Or an ancient somber smithing stone, uh, which I have none of. There's one just sitting around in the DLC somewhere, though. I can't remember where, but there is- Oh no, it's on the way to Bell! Isn't there one on the way to Bell, or is that just a regular stone? Either way, it's on a plus nine right now, so. Honestly, if I had forgotten and then died and lost those runes and forgot to level it up, I would have just been like, well, I'll just kill this boss and use its runes, because that's kind of what happens. <laughs> True. Damn, really. Sir, I'm really sick of the fact that you don't bleed. close to getting thrust again <laughs> you little shithead that's right that's what you deserve no Oh my god, his- his fucking arm got in the way! Get shit on, bro. Yeah, let's get out from the wall. Oh, can we get away from the wall? Are you fucking serious? Again? Die! 
right now. Yeah, let's go. This is the one. Ooh, ha, ooh, ha, ooh. That's two bosses down in one stream. Wow. Let's go. Thank you, Talos. Thank you, ACR. I appreciate it. I fucking did it. That's two bosses down today. That's huge. That's huge. Massive. Enormous. You did it. Let's go. Very nice. Thank you, Kutherton. Wow. Honestly. Yeah. And that's also a really nice little change of pace here, you know. Um, we do need to do Teoli's quest, because if you think I'm gonna do gank fest without my boys, you are sorely mistaken. Poor Saint Trina. Let's imbibe. Don't forget Ansbach. Yeah. And luckily, like, the Ansbach via quest is so nice because I can literally just do the Ansbach side. I just do the Ansbach side of the quest and then ignore Freya and we're golden. Freya doesn't show up. Ansbach is goaded. Like, <laughs> it's a sin not to have him there. On to best boss, Jory. Oh wait, what am I doing? Here, I'll come back and do the Teolier quest. Maybe we should start working on that right now, since we're here. Yeah, Jory's scary. I don't know if I want to fight him today. Jory makes me want to hurl. Bro, guess what? I saw Saint Trina. Oh, be you the tarnished lady? Let us under the tarnished. My name is I too. Oh, are you not affected? I'm feeling rather lost. St. Trina would kindly befall in. The problem is, I would suck. I, I, is this all a plot? Oh, heavens, what am I saying? You deserve. I will make to the southern coast. Sounds good, bunny. I'll meet you there. I'm gonna travel there right now. A week later. <laughs> How did they get there? I mean, they don't have grass. So, like, am I, like, time traveling? Oh, Saint Trina. Oh, Saint Trina. Freaking simp, I love him. He's my favorite. Freaking love Saint Trina. Poor, poor lass. So bad. I know, like, she's, like, literally Radagon America thing going on here. Thank you to think I'm drifting. Which, by the way, this proves to me that Radagon America could be a part. Right? Oh, you mustn't. It could be a part. So I think the Rolana, the Renala, fuck. <laughs> the Renala thing was like legitimate and not just, you know. Anyway, let's drink the lean. And that, you know, over time, eventually Radicon had to go back because he was too weak apart from his other half, America. And that's why he abandoned her. Renala. I had that theory before the the DLC even came out. And I feel like the St. Trina Mikola thing kind of proves my point. So I never take back my theory. And I think I'm right. I gotta listen to Trina. I'm glad that the runes are here. Right here. So I can just pick them up on the way back to go drink some more drugs. Drinking drugs. I look so cursed. Like, look at my, like, my legs. Look, just my hairy thighs. <laughs> well, I'm very impression they were initially apart, but then joined together. Yeah, St. Trina is her own being because cast her aside, no, yeah. Well, I feel like, um, he did cast her aside for the purpose of like, St. Trina was like, no, we shouldn't do this. It's a bad idea. And then he was like, you know what? I have no more use for you. You are just annoying. And you keep trying to tell me not to do this. And I'm going to do it. But I kind of feel like... If he wanted to, he probably could have taken her back. But he didn't. 
He abandoned her. He kicked her down the cliff. He was like, I don't want to play with you anymore. Blech. I'm under the impression they were initially apart and then joined together. I almost wonder that, like, the thing is, is Radagon is like Merica's shadow because he uses impenetrable thorn incantations. He uses, he has the same, like, moves as things in the land of shadow. So it's literally like Radagon is the shadow of... Oh, I hear a voice in my death. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Anyway, yeah. There's like a whole bunch of stuff. I want to do like a deep dive into a couple things that I think deserve another look at. And Radagon, Melina, and then the Windmill Village is like the three things that I'm like, yeah, I think these need another look. <laughs> I think it needs another look. Because there's just some things I think now that we know some stuff from like the DLC, especially a lot more about Merica, like it kind of feels like we could maybe put some things together from like some dialogue or something, you know? Melida deserved more attention, Sag. I know. I know she totally did. I will. I will never For your forgive trespass, you. You will know my poison. Where, where do you spawn? Ah. Oh, scary. Will you please stop backing away, you coward. Stop it. I'm poisoned! <laughs> I'm so dead. Yeah, all we got about Melina was younger sister of Mesmer and that. Why did you mislead me? Such strength for what? Teolia has died. What have I done? This is called forceful recruitment. Nice. Easy. Um, easier than Quelag. Hilarious. And I was poisoned. Embarrassing, honestly. Now I have to imbibe the nectar one more time. Look at how he's in such despair. He's like literally like licking the floor. Poor guy. I'm dead again. The simping knows no bounds, yeah. Listen, I'm all for simping, so I support him, but he um attacked me, so like what the heck? Why I didn't deserve that. <laughs> I did not deserve that. Prison. The cage divinity is beyond saving. See, and I feel like this also, that dialogue right there, is what he knew about America. Like, caged divinity is a prison, and it's not worth saving. And, like, I feel like he knew that about his mom, but he didn't care. He was like, St. Trina, shut up. <laughs> so violent. Hey, uh, anybody have a good night? Have a good night, Aries. Thanks for being no here. Week as a kid to have a good night. We'll see you uh, later. We'll talk to you later. What did she tell me? Tell me, assuming you what did. Oh, I, I think I have to come back here later. All right, chat. Let's see here. How much of the map is open to us? I can literally, I have so many bosses I can literally go to right now. Um, see, why be God when you can be Lord of the DLC? You can call yourself Shadow Lord. Ooh, and you can wear the knockoff Sauron armor. I'm 
I am the edge lord. The edge lord. Mm. <laughs> yeah, why be God when just be not God? Um. Now, if I run, oh, I don't have the bubble on. But if I run straight into Ansbach, um, the the NPCs actually stop trying to kill me. Usually they do. I might eat my words right now. See? Righteous tonic after unburned, but there was one so. After Lord, it appears his and taken. Surely you after fate I do any. I know you would, Onspock. Onspock is the best. Oops. He wants to become a god to get a piggyback ride on Radon. That's the official lore. Oh my god, you're so right. What the fuck? Bro. See, they don't come in here because they're afraid of Onspock. Nee, 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 nee. Ah! Yeah, you won't come in here because you're afraid of Onsbach, you little bitch. Uh, I, I, how do I get back? No, you're not supposed- you're not allowed in here! Bro. Oh, <gasps> wow, hello. I'm not even two-handing it. Jesus. Onspock is actually Giga Chad. Has the most glorious dialogue out of any man PC. He fucking dies or Don refuses to elaborate. Yeah. He's the best. He's so cool. I love him. I absolutely adore him with like every fiber of my being. He is so cool. He is so freaking cool. Imagine being Onspock. Couldn't be me. I am not that cool. I'm simply not that cool. I wish I could be though. Cause that would be lit. He's so sick. And my favorite part about him is he's not even mad that we killed Moak. He's like, you know what? No, you killed him in honorable combat. It's okay. And I was like, thank you. It's really nice of you to say, most people just get mad at me for murdering everyone, but you, you care. Wait, where in the hells am I? Oh, oh, oh it's over here. Hee -he, I'm fucking dead, by the way. I'm dead, by the way. I have to get on the toes. Oof. Easy. Nice. Skadoosh. What is this one? This is his other arm, huh? Yep. So weird to encounter someone who's relatively normal in these games, right? He's just like, really cool. I just remember being like, my first playthrough though, I thought he was sus. Cause he was so normal. I was like, what is wrong with you? Why are you being weird? <laughs> Tech horn sign, invade sign? Where, that's kind of where I'm going. Is it outside of the, Mesmer place where the fire guy is. Let me see. Horn scent. Horn scent. Uh, I'll do Letta quest. She'll be Letta. I want to see. Hmm. <laughs> Let's see here. Horn scent. Suggesting Teoli will leave Leda to ruminate on his allegiance to St. Trina over Mikola, but will conclude that he is not a threat because of his the dual nature of St. Trina and Mikola. <laughs> Leda's like, yeah, Teoli is kind of a bitch, so we're not. Um, let's see. This is what happens when you suggest no one. Oh, if you suggest no one, she'll go after Horn scent too. That's cool. Okay. At the Shadow Keep. If you've progressed it and Leta has decided to pursue him, you have a chance to battle one of them at Shadowkeep. Once you reach the main gate plaza, you'll work your way to the storefront house through a bridge. 
that lined. Oh, the one with the. It is the one with the fire boats. Okay. So we got to go backwards down the elevator from the first floor, Grace. Okay. I see where this is. Very nice. Okay. Am I going to be able to take it? Oh, I am. Cool. Because if I can avoid, since Hippopotamus is not a remembrance boss, I'm kind of like, although she hasn't said whether or not she's decided to kill him, but it's all good. Um, actually, before that, I'm going to be right back because I need to use the bathroom. So, BRB. I freaking love Moog. Well... I love fighting Moog. I don't necessarily like Moog. He's kind of fucking weird. Sorry, I stole your kill. You stole- You stole my kill and then you sent me in the face! <laughs> Why would you do that? Do you play so dirty? I'm so sick of your shit. This guy, this guy can die. Rip. Watch out, here I come. What the fuck? Tentacles! Yes! I love the tentacles. Ah, shit. Oh! <laughs> What if you jump on him like a Mario shell? I'm not sure if we can. Did you see he just like, that's so horrible. He just like punted us into the air. My God. I will, I will go inside and I'll try to get a picture. Why? Cause I'm a professional. What the fuck? I fucking died? Who killed me? Well, uh, minus one death, I guess. Or plus one death. <sighs> OMG, stream over? <gasps> no, Karthik, it's not. You play Desi 2? Twinsies for real, for real. Yeah. I haven't really been playing recently. But yeah, I used to do Destiny Tuesdays on the channel. And then I kind of got a little bit burnt out on Destiny, so I'm kind of in like a weird... I've actually been playing... Oh, you... You killed me. I've actually been playing Elder Scrolls Online lately. I don't know why, but I'm trying like the new class that I missed from like two years ago. And like, it's actually so fun. Oh! Eee! No! I'm so dead! I haven't played since before Final Shape. You should definitely play Final Shape though. It's so good. You fucking bitch. <laughs> I, I was so close to winning. <laughs> Man, I would have won if I had just drank my flask. That totally would have been it. <laughs> Bungie is burnt out too. For real. Yeah. Apparently Bungie is also burnt out. And I think that might be kind of the reason why I'm a little bit well, frankly, also kind of burnt out myself because, like, I'm just, like, <sighs> sad. <laughs> but the final shape was amazing. Like, it was so good. And it was really worth playing. And I, and I want to continue because I was enjoying it, but I don't know. I feel like after they did all those layoffs and stuff, and I was just kind of like, <sighs> I don't know if I can play this game right now. <laughs> I've kind of fallen out with my friend group that plays that. Ah, uh, it happens. And I don't enjoy looking for grouping. Yeah, that's a mood. I also don't like that. I have my fire team. Bye. If you give me your sword, I'm going to scream. Okay, cool. I don't need to scream. I wouldn't scream anyway. I'm just being drama. Oh, it's right here.
It is not here. Unless it's on the other side. You'll get upgrade materials and you will like it. <laughs> no, not upgrade materials. Miyazaki, please. This is where it should be, huh? It's not here, though. Oh, yeah, it's totally supposed to be right here. Let me go back to Leda. Mmm. Yeah, let me go back. Actually, you know what? Since I'm literally right here, I'm fucking dead. Never mind. I'm actually gonna go grab the grass down here so I don't have to like travel back. Thinking ahead for the future. <sighs> Them laying off an additional 200 employees is rough. Yeah, Karthik, it was that kind of, like I was like, bro, what the fuck? shirt uh like when i heard that it was just like despair i was like really didn't you guys like just lay people off i swear like what the hell are you guys doing and i am not a fan of the ceo he can it's my butt bigger brain yeah we gotta prep to <laughs> for jory oh and then what's even worse is i have to get through the entire catacomb to get to jory Thankfully, I'm a god at game. So, you know what? It actually won't even be that bad. It'll be fine. Surely. Holy dark. My eyes just had to adjust to that. It's so much darker than the base game. Love the confidence. <laughs> well, I mean, I'm a professional runner. It's kind of what I do. So, you know, it's... I'm a coward, basically, is what I'm trying to say. I don't like fighting things. Okay, let's see here. Uh, to Leda. <laughs> yes, queen, do your thing. <laughs> True. I will always do my thing. What's up, Kate? What are you doing, bro? He's hyper. Leda. Allow me Allow me- Dude, I think we have to kill fucking Hippo. That's gonna make me cry. Uh, if you progress Hornsen's questline and Leta has decided to pursue him. What is Hornsen's questline then? Is Hornsen's questline the freaking Hippo? Cade, get away from me, bro. He just like knocked down like four things. Ugh. I just put Horsen. Horn... Line. Elden Ring, please don't make me fight the hippo. I just really want to avoid having to fight him. Let's see here. Horse scent, yeah. <laughs> See, so it doesn't say make sure you return and exhaust his dial. Once you got to the main gate plaza, you'll work your way to the storehouse front. <sighs> Horse scent. Bro. Think not to him, lest you too. Think not to lest you. Did I not exhaust his dialogue before? Maybe that was the problem? We'll try one more time, and if not, I'll just cry about it and we'll go somewhere else. What boss should I fight next, chat? Who should I fight next? Um... I could... 
to try to get Mateer over with. Meteor. Or I could go through the church and go down to, like, Skadoosh Tree or him. I try to you'll be able to summon Horns and assist you in fighting. Once the boss is defeated, return. She will ask... She will ask you whether she should go after three. No matter what you suggest, she will decide to go after one set. This will cost soon some signs of I'm getting some conflicting information because I'm getting like, you don't need to. And then I'm also getting like, you need to kill the hippopotamus. And I'm trying to avoid killing the hippopotamus because that sounds like But what's worse, killing, learning the hippopotamus? Or having horn sent in the NPC gank fight. I don't know which one is worse. Honestly. What if I can I open the door down here? Do you think I can open this door? You could probably let horn sent solo him. True. Open? Nope, it doesn't open. If you the paper but the, 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 the if the hippopotamus isn't dead, it's over. I don't want to kill the hippo. Okay, you know what? Screw it. We'll we'll see. We'll check. Screw it. We will see how poorly it goes. And if it goes really poorly, then we'll cry about it and try and figure something out. I just I've seen how bad like horn scent is so bad in the gank fest. Like he's terrible. And Letta and Dryleaf Dane are already so horrible in their own right. So, like, having him in the gank fight at RL1 sounds like something I, like, that would probably make me want to throw up. <laughs> uh, he's awful. I forgot to kill him. Made my life so much worse. Yeah. Now, I don't know, too, either, because there is also another option. But honestly, I want to have... Wait, what? Oh, so now he's gone. Okay. Like, I don't want to solo him because I could just like, I think you just need to summon him for Mesmer like once. And if you summon him, then it counts. Like he doesn't have to actually like be there, but then you have to solo him before Romina. And that is horrible too. Like he is scary. And room level one, that's even worse. Like... <laughs> I would rather fight Bull Cut Man like four times. Hippo is blocking Horn Scent. Yeah, he's blocking Horn Scent. Damn, I should have summoned for Mesmer. Yeah. If you summon him, if you don't summon him at all, he will be mad because you took away his chance for, for killing Mesmer. But if you summon him just once and then you die, I think it will trigger him to go to Romina afterwards, so... Yeah, he was all depressed after. Yeah, he gets like super, oops. He gets like super upset if you don't summon him at least once. I'm like, bro, then why are you in the middle of the arena? <laughs> then why are you in the middle of the arena? <laughs> well. We'll give it a shot. Is Cade Please, for the love of God. We'll give it a couple shots just to like see what it's like. I need you to... What? Hi. You good? <laughs> yeah, he's like, who took away my opportunity to murder Mesmer? How dare you? I'm like, oh, sorry. That was on me. <laughs> I did that. We're not going to use NPCs. It's way too much health. So we're just going to pray. Hello, hippo. Yikes. Oh. Okay. What is your weaknesses? Are, do you not? I'm so dead. Do you not bleed, bro? Kate, you're annoying. What is your weaknesses?
Okay, Kate, you've got to go. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I grabbed you awkwardly because you were in an awkward position. Show me hippo potato, hippo, golden, hippo, weakness, Elden Ring, question mark. He is severely weak to fire damage. What? <laughs> Weakest to lightning and slash. Okay. Let me try some lightning then. I will try it. Yeah, the first thing I thought was fire, and that doesn't feel right. Let's try some lightning. And slash. Cannot be bled, question mark? Oh man, it's just that the second phase is so scary. <laughs> if I get hit by even one little pork in the hole, I'm over. Ah! Oh yeah, that's much better. I'm dead. I'm alive? And buffs lightning. He can be bled in Frostbite. Okay. I'm dead. Oh. Oh shit, he turned into a porcupine. <laughs> I'm dead. I'm alive. I messed up. <laughs> well. That is very possible. I messed up though. I couldn't really see what he was doing. So I just guessed and then I was wrong. <laughs> yeah, dooba dooba dooby like that. Should have healed. Yeah, I didn't really realize that I had been hit. <laughs> and then I greeted. <laughs> oh my god, it's a raid? Oh my god. Hello. I'm I'm gonna die. I can't see. I'm <laughs> I got trapped in a corner. Holy welcome in. <laughs> Honey bear, thank you so much for the raid. I am not subbed. What? Bl yeah, blue, blue, bluesy, you're not subbed. What the heck? Welcome in. Also, hello, everybody. Oh my God. Oh my God. Epic fail. <laughs> no, it's not a fail. It's okay. <laughs> How's it going, y'all? Oh my God. We got so many. Honey bear link. Kelp. Tiny milk cat. It's Mousa. Potato Tycoon. Oh my god, that's like what the kind of boss we're fighting. We're fighting a hippo potato. Also, thank you for the follow. Thank you for the follow. Follows are anonymous, so if you want to lurk or chat, you're more than welcome to do what you need to. Hello, raiders. What are you up to? What what are we what 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 were we doing? I've been lurking for your R01 playthrough and had to come and bring friends. Oh my god, you are so freaking kind. Thank you so much. Let me give you a shout out. What were you doing? <gasps> Bloodborne? Thank you for the follow. What were you doing in Bloodborne? Professional yapper. I love that. <laughs> thank you so much. That's so kind of you. Well, thank you for lurking. I appreciate that. You've been ratting for Deathless? Let's go! You see, Bloodborne's actually my next game. So I'm quite excited about that. That's awesome. Well, also, if you have to raid and run, I totally get it. That goes for not just you, but anyone who came with the raid. 
totally understand. We're gonna try to kill the Hippopotamus. Um, we almost got him, but I didn't heal, and so now I'm dead. <laughs> I, or, or I died, and now we gotta try again. That's great. Thank you so much for the raid. That's so kind. Thanks for trusting me with your community. We have beaten uh, three remembrances so far. And my cats are losing their minds. Hope you enjoyed Bloodborne. I'm so excited. I have been wanting to play Bloodborne for so long. Oops. Mm, let me heal. I've been wanting to play Bloodborne for a really long time, but didn't really have the means to do it. Oop, I'm dead. I'm alive. Let me heal. No, I thought this was gonna be way worse than it than it is. So, yeah, I'm really excited. I know like a lot about Bloodborne because I love the lore. Uh oh, I gotta heal. Let me heal. Oh god, I'm I'm so dead. I'm alive. I don't even remember how. To dodge that properly. Oops. <laughs> the Bloodborne lore is so good. Drip. It is, it's so good. Lady Maria. I feel like it's a sin I've never gotten to fight her before because I just love her. Like, she, her OST does not have to be so good, but like, man, it hits hard. Oh my God. Yeah, Lady Maria, Mama Mia, she's the best. I was super nervous to start, but once I got through early game, it became so much fun. Yeah, it's, it's so, oh man. Oh, yikes, whatever. <laughs> Mama Maria step on me, yeah. I actually think oh, I didn't count to death. Oh, Elden Ring is here, true. Did I count to death? You know what, we'll just add another death. Just because I feel like I missed um some. I'm really good at being accurate. <laughs> you didn't count three. One more then. Thank you, Acton. See, my mod's keeping me accountable. appreciate that. <laughs> Someone's got to count the deaths because clearly I'm not. Okay, this is the bad thing. What the hell? Oh my god. Stop. No! The, the, this is the one thing about the golden hippo that I don't like. He's like, his... Like, hitbox for his grab is, like, if he starts the grab in front of your face, you're just dead. <laughs> One more. Thank you. <laughs> One more or 75? Okay, I will wait for you. The hitbox on this hippo is whack. Yeah. Like, his grab attack especially. This boss is straight out of DS2. I've never played DS2. I haven't played DS2 or 1. They're on my list, though. I own them. At someday, I will play them all. And then it will be a real and true Souls player. Not that I'm not already, but like, for real. What what DS2 boss, by the way, though? I'm not super familiar with DS2 as like the other ones, but I don't have the courage to play DS1 or 2. I believe in you. DS2 I played last, in my opinion. Yeah, I was actually thinking of, like, every DS2 boss. Oh. Yikes. Everyone. I kind of thought about playing them, like, backwards. So I played DS3, and then playing DS2, and then DS1. But I've also heard that playing DS1 first is better, but I'm almost like... At least, like, the lore isn't really in order, so, like, you know, I guess I wouldn't have to, but, yeah, hitboxes being whack. What's new?
Now I'm stuck in the corner again. You know, it'd be really cool if I could stop getting cornered. Man, I had that one really good run and now it's just going downhill. We'll go for like 10 more minutes and then and then I, I'll have to start wrapping up for the night. Disc one is kind of janky, mildly brutal, yet fair introduction to the whole souls like genre, but it's old. Yeah, I've been watching Elias do Dark Souls 1 permadeath randomizer. And uh, it definitely is kind of, like you can tell it's old. It's an older game, older. Uh, and like, it's kind of jank, but you know what? Just go to the side instead. The fuck? Hello. Dude, this boss is... <laughs> Heal. <laughs> Stop, bro. Okay, I guess I'm dead now. I dodged and he like scooped me up diagonally, I think. That was weird. <laughs> uh, playing one and two makes three a lot more enjoyable. I believe that. I believe that. I loved three. Oh my God. Dark Souls 3 is so good. It's insane. Trapped in a corner. One of my favorite songs. Yeah. This, this boss is just so mid man it's just so mid it's uh i've heard it's just pretty clunky yeah fantastic lore though and i mean it's got dark souls one has bed of chaos bed of chaos is the boss of all time the boss of all time it's one of those things though where once you zone those things out of it it's really a cool experience yeah that makes sense yeah, and I know a lot of people like either love or hate Dark Souls too, but I'm kind of with it to like try it, you know? Like I definitely want to beat it to say that I've done it. And then I have Demon Souls as well. I'd like to try it. It's also even the remake is genuine. What? Are you serious? <laughs> Son of a nut. This boss makes a lot of sense. Bed of Chaos is goaded, yes. True. Thank you for the follow. This, the boss that deserves to be placed in the bottom of a trash can in hell. What do you mean, Sean? It is the boss of all time. Or you mean Hippopotamus, because <laughs> what was that? His tracking is so good for some reason. It's kind of annoying. I can confirm DS2 isn't as bad as everyone says. I say it's easier than other Souls games, though. And that would make sense. I know that there are some things that, like, when it comes to DS2, people are like, oh my god, like, I wish other Souls games had some of the stuff that DS2 had. Like... Being able to, like, use two different weapons at the same time, I think that's a DS2 thing. This boss is just, ugh, yeah. Yeah, I think I already read that. DS2 is fun, undercooked, but fun. Yeah, that that, ma that makes sense, too. I know a lot of challenge runners like DS2. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's got its charm, for sure. Is it the best one? Maybe not. Uh, that's up to your own opinion, but, like... I think it seems kind of interesting and like, I mean, obviously like it wasn't like Miyazaki. I think Miyazaki only did. Oh, so you don't hit me that time, huh? Holy camera. Jesus. What? Are you si You've gotta be fucking with me. That piece of rock prevented me from getting the repost. Are you kidding me? A 
That's ridiculous. <laughs> I'm kind of salty. <laughs> oh, but now the rock is gone because he crushed it. Yeah, of course. That checks out. Oh, I misread. <laughs> uh, I believe he did every other main one too, but I could be mistaken. Oh, for DS2? Because I thought that like the main story of DS2 was done by somebody else and then Miyazaki did the DLC. Or wait, yeah, but Miyazaki's done like everything else, but I could, I could be wrong. I know that it was different than the other DLCs for sure. And that's why it's got some pretty varying opinions. Like I have hair stuck in my eye? Oh shit. Oh no. That's the worst. I had fur stuck in my eye earlier while fighting the boss. A different boss. What the? Let me get you. Are you serious, bro? Let me heal. <laughs> I'm so scared. <gasps> what? The after wave. Whatever. Dude, repossing him is in this arena is annoying because there's all this like shit on the ground. Why? DS2 was done by someone else while he was working on Bloodborne. So by that logic, if Miyazaki actually helped develop base game, it would be great, if not better. Oh, okay. Interesting. I stand by the fact that they put things in the boss room specifically to make you get stuck on it. I believe it. And they think they're being funny. They're like, hey, hey, what if we stuck like a whole rack of weaponry and like some rubble that the boss can crush? That would be so cool. Like, look at this shit. Look at that. You know what? Just hit him again. Again. What? Ah! No, bro. <laughs> so this is like totally possible. It's just kind of annoying, but it'll be worth it because at the end, we won't have to deal with horn scent in the gank squad, which is really important to me for this to be tolerable at the end. I don't even believe that the boss, uh, oh, well, let's see. Gascoigne, beloved. Yes, Gascoigne. Also, it's got like one of my favorite, like, What's that guy with like the he has like the bird cage on his head? <laughs> 282 now. Look at Acton. Acton's really on it. Thank you so much. <laughs> Mikalash, yeah, where he says, like, oh how like whatever. Like that line is so good. <laughs> I don't even believe that when bosses get to 20 HP, a little intercom goes off and Miyazaki himself plays at the boss. I believe it. I super believe Hair has been removed. Welcome back, Alice. Uh, ooh, majestic. <laughs> I hate him. He makes me laugh so hard. I know that the boss is like, the boss fight is like kind of scuffed. Cause you have to like run around and chase him and stuff. And there's like other ads or whatever. So it's like super scuffed. But just like his dialogue is so good. Like he didn't have to do. Do the most, but he did. Majestic. You know what? It's more damage. I'm dead. <laughs> no, I actually think his repost might his poise like resets when he go when he phases. <sighs> Damn. Oh, do I have a video of cut content of Mikalash's voice actor? It's so funny. 
Shaw, please, if you find it, please share it. I want to see it. Grantus eyes, Grantus eyes. Yeah. Hi, this was Scooby Snacks? It is. We are currently at 13. I think I'm just going to go to 14 and then we'll be good. But this is with the skadoosh. Welcome in, Black Marvel. Okay, we're going to do like two more tries and then I think we're going to call it. I'm, I'm going longer than I usually do. But I wanted to be, I wanted to kill the horn scent, bro. Lord. I'm stuck in the wall. I can't see. Let me heal. Let me do it. Yikes. 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 And then he catches me. Whatever, bro. <laughs> Yikes. I was being kind of greedy, though, so it's whatever. It's whatever. Oh, there's also the other boss in Bloodborne. The one before Lady Maria. There's like the failed experiments or something. That fight <laughs> seems so funny to me, too. What are they called? They're like failed experiments. Some of the bosses in Bloodborne, like I want to fight them because they just seem like so much fun. And they seem like messed nice up. And weird, and I love that. Like eldritch horrors. Living failures, that's that's what they're called. Yeah, failed experiments. Same, same diff, you know? What in the yikes? Are you serious again? I'm dead. I'm I'm alive. I'm alive. I'm a I'm a dead. Greatest boss theme song to a mediocre boss. They went way too hard for some bigger blue blobs. Yeah. <laughs> the music. Oh my god. Bloodborne OST is just insane. Like Ludwig, Maria. Like, oh man, they're so good. And then what's the other one? The one that always screams all the time. The boss fight is just mostly them screaming, but if you take the screaming away, the OST is also really good. Crap, I see, I don't remember any of those, but there's another one. Yeah, I'm gonna have to be more specific. There's a lot of screaming bosses in Bloodborne. I'm aware of this. Um, shoot. I feel like she was a, a girl. Her lore is that she turned into a monster. Oh, I'm dead. All right. <laughs> I think. Vicar Amelia. Yeah. That OST. That OST is crazy, too. An Orphan of Cost, right? Orphan of Cost also has a good OST. They all do, but like. Same one as Cleric Beast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So good. Like, the, it's just such a good song. Man, I love it. Anyway, chat. We're gonna call it. We beat two bosses today. Two. That's huge. Two, not just like any bosses. We beat two Remembrance bosses. Rolana and Putrescent Knight are down. And it was super duper fun. Orphan of Cost can suck my butt. <laughs> just all the screaming. Look at listen, he just he just got born. Hey, he's disoriented. <laughs> GG today. Thank you so much, honey bear. Thank you for the raid and also lurking. It was very, very kind of you sharing your community. Um, let's find someone to raid. <gasps> we got another rune level one person we can raid. Oh shit. Girl only started her stream up recently, so this is a good place to send you. We're gonna send you to Kaylee Strawberry. She's doing DLC uh R01, all bosses. So not just remembrance bosses, all bosses, and she's cracked. So let's get our butts over to her and let her know who we are and that we're feral and that we're ready to go, chat. 
we'll see you guys on Saturday. Saturday for more. And then... Yeah. And then that's it. Have a good night, everybody. Thanks so much for being here. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye.